In this video, I show you how to fix Discord not launching or starting. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. I really do appreciate it. And please do watch this video right until the end to so the full steps. And let's go and get straight into this. Here we are on my desktop and we're doing this on Windows 11, but it's also going to work on other versions of Windows as well. The first thing you need to do is just because Discord isn't actually launching, it may still be running in the background of your computer, so you need to make sure it's fully closed. So all you want to do is go and click on the magnifying glass and you want to go and search for Task Manager. So go and search for Task Manager, just like so, go and open it up and here we are. Then all you want to do is make sure Discord is not in the apps list and just check out the um, background process in a minute as well. As you can see, there are quite a few Discords open. So all you want to do is go through that and close them. I ended the task and then it closed them all actually. So there we go. Then you want to close off of Task Manager and we're going to get into the next step. Actually go and uninstall Discord, but that's not just the whole guide. I'm showing you some other really important steps to go and get it to go and launch. So all you want to do is go and click on the magnifying glass just here and you want to go and search for add or remove programs just like so and it's going to go and find the best match. So go and click on it just like so. So it's going to take a moment to load and then you're going to be on the app list and all you want to do is go and click on search apps and go and search for discord just like so and here it is. Then all you need to do is come onto the right hand side and you want to go click on these three dots here and go and click uninstall and then you're going to get another uh, message saying this app and it's related to be uninstalled and go and click uninstall again and now it's going to do nothing, nothing is going to be visible but it's actually going to be uninstalling it in the background and all you need to do is go and wait because in a moment you, as we search for discord it's going to go and say no apps found so just wait until it says that message and then within 10 seconds it's saying we couldn't find anything to show here or you can just go and refresh the search and it should go and show you that as well but that isn't quite it you need to come onto your keyboard and go and press on the windows key and the r button just like so and it's going to go and launch something called run and what you want to do is type in percentage app data percentage and then go and press ok and it's going to go and launch this folder here and with all of your app data in. Then all you need to do is go and find Discord. So as you can see, here it is. And you want to go and delete this file here, well, this folder here. So right click on it just like so and go and click on show more options. And then all you want to do is go and press delete. And as you can see, it's going to delete it just like so. And then you want to go and close off of this folder here. Then once again, you want to go and press the Windows key on your keyboard and the R button. And you're going to, going to go and get the run. What you need to do is add, add local in front of the app data, but behind the percentage. So it's going to look something like this percentage, local app data percentage, and then go and press OK. Then once again, it's going to launch this folder up and you want to go and look for Discord. As you can see, here it is at the bottom. Then all you want to do is right click on it and you want to go and click on show more options and then go and press on delete again. And it's going to go and delete it. So now I'm ready to go and reinstall Discord to go and open up your browser. So here we are on Google. So I'm just going to go and search for Discord just like so and go to discord.com. Here we are. And then all you need to do is go and press on the download to Windows button just like this. And it's going to go and start the download. Every browser will show their downloads differently. In Chrome, it's put in the bottom left. But if you can't find your download in the browser, but you just need to go and open up your file explorer and then you can go and check out uh, your downloads folder and all your downloads can be listed there. So let's go and run this setup now. So I'm going to go and click on it just like so and nothing really happens when you do a Discord setup. It may go and do some downloads depending um, on when you uninstalled it. Um, but as you can, uh, mine Discord is fully up to date so not much is actually going to happen. So all you need to do is sit back. As you can see it's doing some downloads. We can come and close off of Chrome and just wait and it's going to go and install them. And now it's starting up. And Discord is now successfully opened and it's now working completely fine. If you found this video useful, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like for more. Peace.